So this is uh, how the small kit would come. Screws. Things might shift in movement. A little water deflector. are 3D printed, so the imperfections will happen sometimes uh, as I get the printer more tuned in, these will go away, but honestly they do nothing to uh, harm the quality, so it's, um, it's not a big deal. Uh, if you don't like them, you can sand them down or something, uh, but it doesn't affect everything out. Should have six of these. Three of them need to have this little piece. And then three of them do not. That allows it to use the same interlocking. So I want to set these guys We're going to speed things up here a little bit. Basically, what I'm doing is alternating the direction of the screws. You can use coarse screws like I am here, or if you get the kit, it's going to come with um, some bolts and nuts. Okay, now that we've got the lid assembled, we can start putting the whole thing together. So we'll start by putting the pump into the bucket. We can run the power cord up and out through the hole in the lid. Press the lid down. We don't need to permanently attach it right now. So there are holes on the side if you wanted to. Um, this piece is optional. Uh, just kind of keep stuff from falling in the hole. While still having a little bit of room for your cords. So now we're going to grab our hose and the first piece. We're just going to run it right through the middle. Is a convenient little circle guide for you. So just press it through and then pull. We're not super worried about getting this exactly to the right length right now. So just leave yourself some extra. We'll twist and lock the first one and we'll start just repeat the process with the second one. Press it through, pull, twist and lock. One more time. the hose a little bit and pull it tight quite as much as we need. Um, you'll notice the hose here is a little bigger. It's not the right size but for demo purposes it shows you what you need to know. So now that's attached. We'll pull the hose from the bottom end and from the top end we can push just a little bit. Line it up, twist and lock. Go. We'll take the excess hose, put it down through the hole, connect it to your pump, twist and lock the tower. Make sure everything's nice and tight. We can install this optional distribution piece. It's like a deflector. And we put on the vented lid, and that's it for the tower. So now we're going to show the net pots. There's a couple different styles of these, but they all use this interlocking system similar to the rest of it. Just slide it in, line it up, twist the lock. <laughs> 